Hello guys, welcome back to some more Borderlands 2. Last time we collected some side quest stuff, did some side quest stuff, and now we're gonna return everything back to the original space or place or wherever we're going with this. And I'm gonna help him propose to Natalie, I think she was called. So that's always something. Some might say that my, by completing these quests for Shade, you are enabling his delusional behavior and accelerating his downward spiral into madness. Those people are stupid. Oh, these pirate things are so wonderful. Jocko will love them almost as much as he loves telling those hilarious jokes and not being dead of thirst. Yes, very true, very true. And stalkers are always cute and fuzzy until they grow up. Very yeah. true, too. Money. Woo. Thank you, thank you. More enthusiasm. Woohoo! <laughs> I'm here to bring some nice alcohol to you. Give I'm whiskey. I'm a tough man who says tough things in a growly voice. I can tame corrupted. I can. You have a problem, Frank. You're so drunk you're speaking the gibberish. <sighs> Please return to me, friend. I fear Frank is beyond help. Uh, that's fine. It's fine. Don't worry. Do a, what is the word? Intervention. Maybe. It's probably for the best that Frank is already dead. That Boo she just collected would have killed him anyway. Of course it would have. I am very good. Wingman, propose to Natalie. Really, I have to go all the way up there to propose. Oh my goodness. <laughs> What kind of proposal are you hoping for, dude? It's apparently a very tough one. I don't have to climb buildings to get up there. And even that might not even be enough. More health. Need help, man. Don't you worry, I got you, I got you. I got all the health you could ever need. All you gotta do is say the word and I'll be there. Health. Okay, alright, I will I lied. But anyway, still still I think Just I'm becoming him now. The ring onto her finger and see what she says. Alright, let's do this. Hello! Oh shade! Marriage! Moving so fast, and you know, I don't believe in marriage. I'm sorry, Shade, but the answer is no. Did he just reject himself? She said no. Oh, woe is me. I gave you my heart, Natalie. Return to me, friend. At least you have not betrayed me yet. I love how you said yet. Like, I'm gonna be, I will betray you, but you know, not yet, at least, you know. But I'm just kind of happy you catch on to it before I know I felt bad about betraying you at one point. Alright. Let's turn Shade down. Thank thankfully ensuring that the two will never share a honeymoon. I, I thankfully do that too from me, I, will, I must say. Uh, I, I hope they don't ever share a honeymoon. If that, if that was the case, I would be very, very scared of playing this game anymore. No, I wouldn't. I would still play it. I, I, I was lying. But, but still. More rooms. Wait, you're going now? We were just beginning to connect. No, we were not. Goodbye, Shade. Nice to meet you. By the way. <laughs> nice to meet you and goodbye. I'm looking for... What am I looking for, by the way? Is it here or is it above? It seems like it's over here, no? Is it really in the palm tree? My goodness. Okay, I, I guess this is how it works. Uh, palm tree it is. I have no idea how I'm gonna get up there, but okay. I guess it's just right here. Not that big a deal. I'm looking for that pirate booty. 
You wouldn't happen to know where I can find some pirate booty? I guess not. Ah, okay, I guess no explosions. Wait, 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 give me a second. This is skin. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, you know, totally ignore the fact that I'm entering combat and just throw wow. something away and then pick this up and take it and use it, you know? You guys are not even worth it. And it was supposed to be an insult, by the way. Right there, right between the eyes. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Don't want to do that. How about we talk things out, like real gentlemen? When I say talk things out, I really mean shoot you in the head while you listen to me ramble on about talking to you. Precisely like I do things right now. Oh, they actually downed me. Wow, okay. I'm just way too high level for actually fighting these guys right now. The pirates! I know it may not seem like it, but I'm actually a very big fan of pirate games. I haven't played any yet. So, yeah, but I actually am. So, if you guys know of any great pirate games out there, you know, I, I'm, I'm gonna play Assassin's Creed Black Flag at one point. I don't know if I do that now or later on, but yeah. I'm gonna do that and everything else, so yeah. Uh, a message in a bottle, maybe it'll lead to some trash. Yeah, spoilers, it will. <laughs> a message in a bottle on top of a palm tree. I don't even want to know how it got there. How do you get into a palm tree? I look for the palm tree and climb onto it. How do you do it? I just, you know, the way I come onto a palm tree is just... I just start here on it one day. That's how it works. And then you find a bottle with me. And it'll lead you right to a treasure. I don't know if this is an area I'm not supposed to be in or what this is, but that's wait, is that Scarlet? I think that's her ship. I'm not supposed to go there yet. I am busy looking for treasure. If I can find it anywhere. Wait, is it on top of that? Hmm. Seems like it's actually on top of this thing. How am I supposed to get up there now? I guess walking would be an option. And then like climbing. No, no it's not because it doesn't show that I can do that. I'm just gonna go to Scarlet and hope that this leads me up there sometime. Clink <clears throat> throat. Always necessary. I think I actually found the way in by accident right now. <laughs> Alright. I will take it. Oh, it's because they're using bottles, not actual grenades. That explains quite a lot, actually. Quite a lot indeed. Throw grenades! Watch out for my fearsome grenades, they will annihilate you. Never mind, you did. Not one of those bad villains that takes forever to talk and the hero's already dead. It's like, oh man, I want you to listen to me. Very disappointed now. 
Right, it's a treasure. You're supposed to be around here somewhere. Just look for a big X. That's what I'm looking for. I'm guessing this is the big X. I mean, it looks like a big X anyway. No, it does not. Oh, this is the X. After two years, you found it. Sandbars and zero casualties. I think the men are starting to unravel. They want to kill stuff. They want to split the loot in their separate ways. They don't seem to get the fact that our whole operation isn't about greed or bloodlust. It's about survival. It's about survival. You know, that's just a pirate life, you know. A pirate's life, I mean. You, you, you fight to survive at the beginning and then later on you get hypnotized by the fact that you can... We start I don't know. Ships, we starve. We split up. We die. I won't let that happen. But that's just how it works. Come on, show yourself. I want to kill you at least once with this thing. This shield on. That's very annoying, by the way. Come on. Just, just attack me. What is the curse of elementals? What does it even do? Aha! There we go. And I'm gonna remove it again. This bonus explodes the damage to only the Yeah, curse of the elementals. I don't understand what it does, but okay. I will take it. So according to this, this shield is only supposed to have 1,900 uh, ah. shield. But because of my either bonuses to my character or my actual badass points, it is way bigger than that. I think it's a mix of both. So not too bad, not too bad at all. More corrosive stuff. Also not too shabby. Oh yeah. Huh, that is skiff coming from Oasis. That's a Alright, well Sandman wants your part of the compass, bitch. Hand it over. And I'm being attacked. Great, wonderful. Hey, stranger, you give me a hand with Sandman's boys. I'll make it worth your while, alright? Uh okay, I don't mind. Not that hard. I already got this, as you can clearly see. Huh, killed them all. Nice. Get up here and we can talk business. Uh like from the fact that I heard Cranma that time talk about how you tried to kill me and we fought or something. Like, I, I thought we were gonna fight each other, but apparently we're friends with her. I really thought we were gonna be enemies. Maybe it was like a friendly duel or something, but she, was, she said she was alive after we defeated her, so maybe it was like a duel. I guess so, but it's also just been a new use station. I really have no idea, but we will see how it goes in the future. Captain on deck. That's me, by the way. I'm, I'm the captain. The hell's a vault hunter doing out here? Ooh. Nice moves out there. You're a vault hunter, yeah? 
Never met one of you guys before. The guns, the power, it's all very striking. If you're looking for the treasure of the sands, you've come to the right chick. But, God, oh, I'm being rude. I haven't even introduced myself to that a lot. Sorry. I'm, um, Captain Scott. Okay. We'll absolutely stab you in the back. Okay. Nice to meet ya. She's not hiding her true nature, at least. It's in front of me when it comes to her actions, but maybe her personality? This is Captain Scarlet. Her interests are treasure, adventure, and shooting unarmed people. Oh, right. I, I have the same. Get you up to speed on the legend of the treasure, eh? So, the legends say that whoever gets all four pieces of a mystical compass will find the lost treasure. I've got a piece, because I'm awesome, but Sandman has one too. Head to Hater's Folly, kill Sandman, and get his piece of the compass. Sound good? Very good. All right, cool. I like you already, Scarlet. We do have a common interest. Killing unarmed people. Uh, you know, that's about it. I just finished cooking up a badass meal of gasoline and shoe polish, but nobody can enjoy it with Shiv Spike around. Have you met Shiv Spike? He's a radio operator. You should go meet him. Hello there, Shiv Spike. How you doing? I will puke blood into your soul! Kind of an asshole, isn't he? Yeah. And beyond that, he smells like a corpse somebody vomited up. I want to feed Shiv Spike to the sand grubs, but he stinks so bad they won't eat him. <laughs> Get some condiments. We gotta make Shivy look appetizing. Of course, that's true. We have to make him look like they actually want to eat him. Ah, that's just how it is, I guess. Uh... This is to the jackass who just arrived at Oasis. We don't take kindly to independent treasure hunters around here. We're union sand pirates. Now we're calling you out, scab. Our union <sighs> versus you. Hell no, we won't go! Hell no, we won't go! <laughs> okay. Good for you guys. Hey, I'm Mercer, the cook for this dumbass crew. You know the number two top killer of sand pirates? Scurvy. Number one is self-inflicted gunshot wounds, but that ain't really my department. Oh, Give okay. me some fruit, will ya? Okay, no, not too bad, not too bad. I'll get you some fruit. Don't you worry. Here's some good old nice delicious fruit. Whoops. I I really mean it when they just appear out of nowhere in front of me. I really never mean almost never, unless when I do it on purpose of course, they run into them, you know? I have a boat. Do you have a boat? I do not think so. Do I kill them to get it, or is it like a thing I don't have to kill them, or what? But I'm gonna have to end this video here, guys, by the way, before I start doing this. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. If you wanna see more from me, subscribe to us and click that subscribe button. And I hope to see you guys in my next video. And as always, stay awesome.